this is Zeynep Mercan. This is an analysis of ACCA's March 2024 SPL pre-seed information. We are going to do a quick Portress Five Forces analysis for the football club Athletic Trans Central. Let's have a closer look at the competition in Kyland Football League. Threat of new entrants is low. There are high capital requirements. The league is already established. And for a new team, it will also be possibly hard to attract top talent. Targeting power of buyers. In this case, buyers are fans. Switching costs are low. However, loyal fans have emotional commitment to their team. This decreases the possibility of them switching teams. But they can become uninterested. If the performance keeps declining, they might not want to go and see games. They might not want to support the team anymore. And instead of switching teams, they may become interested in other sports, other entertainment options, other activities. Also, individually, they might not have that much power, but United, they have power. Collectively, they have power. So moderate, maybe too high. Bargaining power of suppliers. In this case, both players and sponsors are suppliers. And I think the best thing here is to think of top tier sponsors and players separately because they have very high bargaining power. Maybe the more mediocre players and smaller sponsors have less power. However, the ones that help you gain competitive advantage, they have a lot of bargaining power. Threat of substitutes. Moderate because there are other sports. However, football is football. It is a significant sport. Even though we are considering this for the industry, for AT, there are no stadiums in the city of Fania. So this creates a lack of substitutes. So I would say moderate. And finally, competitive rivalry is high. Thailand's football scene is very competitive. Teams are competing for the best players, best sponsors, and they're making investments in their training facilities and stadiums. 